Fort Worth makes it official. Police Chief Ed Krause accepted the position on a permanent basis now, but many community members are frustrated by that very announcement. Our Caroline Vandergriff live over at City Hall tonight with more on their concerns on this day. Caroline? Doug, the city didn't conduct a national search or even consider any other internal candidates for this role. There was no public comment period either. So a lot of people say they feel like they were shut out of this process. And I'm extremely honored to continue uh, in this leadership role. After 27 years with the Fort Worth Police Department and six months as chief on an interim basis, Ed Krause will take the department's top job. Very, very, very disappointed embarrassed for our city. Several community organizers were frustrated by the announcement. They say it has nothing to do with Kraus. It's about the process. If you want to create a city that focuses on diversity and inclusion, it doesn't start with excluding people from a very important process, which is choosing the chief of police. City manager David Cook says he got plenty of community feedback about Kraus during his time as chief. We have received so many positive comments about his leadership, about his transparency about his being visible and everywhere in the community. That's why he felt confident offering Kraus the job without opening up a search. Kraus says he knows the department needs to improve community relationships. After the Tatiana Jefferson uh, shooting, that knocked us back several flights of stairs, you know, if we're talking about building up to a trust. One of Jefferson's cousins did come to the announcement to personally shake Krause's hand. I saw it on the news and I said, well, hey, I need to go over and say thank you and congratulate and let the people of Fort Worth know that they have a great man. Next week, the city council will vote on a resolution in support of the decision to keep Kraus as chief. Several of the community advocates we talked to plan to be there to express their concerns. Live in Fort Worth, I'm Caroline Vandergriff, CBS 11 News.